Hi guys! Today we have a game that tests your focus and hand-eye coordination. Look, so you try to get it through the maze, but if it touches, it beeps like this. Oh, and lights up too. Mm -hmm. Alright, Ryan, I go first. And then after that, you go. Let's see if I can finish it. So good. Focusing. Whoa. Focus. Oh, I didn't hear anything. Mm. Oh my gosh. It turns. It goes up and down. Look Ooh, at this. It goes. Like, Please mm. don't shake it. Ah, who's shaking it? Ah. Wait. Oh my gosh. I'm oh doing my it. Gosh. He's Ooh. doing so good. Okay, this is the most difficult part. Turn and go up. <gasps> Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh no, this part's super hard. Oh, no! Welcome to Ryan's world! Oh, okay, we gotta put it back now. Alright, your turn now, Ryan. Can you surpass me? Okay, let's see. I stop right here. Right, right here. Alright, let's see if you can go beyond that. Ready, say, go! Okay, okay. Stay focused, Ryan. Oh. Whoa. Whoa! Oh, I didn't hear anything. Okay, okay, alright, I'll let that go. Just warm up. All right, here we go. Can you do this. Turn around. Turning, turning. Oh my gosh. Turning. Don't let it turn. <laughs> See, this is difficult. Want to make your own version at home? Here's how you do it. Roll the clip. Heck, you rang. Oh, good. Now that you're here, you can build the ultimate Buzzwire game challenge. Buzzwire game? Using a simple circuit we're going to build a game of focus and concentration. That sounds like a great idea. All right, now the four main parts of our circuit is this wire, which is going to be our conductor, this battery, which is going to be our energy source, the light bulb and the buzzer, which is gonna be our electrical load, and this wire, which we're gonna use as our switch. Now, Peck is doing his midday meditation right now, so we are gonna go ahead and get started with the base and the structure of our build. We are gonna use hot glue and cardboard. So we're gonna start by plotting out all of our cardboard pieces to make our base and our structure. The first part is going to be the main part of our base. That's why it's gonna be so big, because we have to put everything on it. And then we're gonna make a little stand for our base using these two skinny pieces. And lastly, we're gonna make the walls for the outside. So now that we have all of our pieces bright and colorful, it's time to start our assembly. We are gonna stick everything together with hot glue. Now, if you're gonna use hot glue, make sure to ask an adult for help. It's really hot. I mean, that's in the name. The first thing we're gonna glue together is the base for our game. Now, we are gonna take these yellow strips and glue them on the back side like this. Now, we're just gonna hold it in place while the glue dries. One side down, one more to go. Uh-oh, we're getting glue everywhere. This is why it's important to ask an adult for help. Now that that is good and dry, we have our base built. Now all that's left is to add the walls. Everything is nice and dry, which means our base is built. Now it's time to build our circuit. So we're gonna start by connecting our two positive wires that's gonna run from our battery to our light bulb. Now we need a good, tight, secure connection. So we're gonna twist and twist and twist and twist until it's nice and secure. Let's check it. Ooh, that is really nice and secure. Now we're going to route our combined positive wires into the positive section of the light bulb and carefully twist it around the screw. There we go, bend it around. Now that we have it bent around our screw, we're going to tighten our screw to secure that connection in place. 
After that's tightened, we should have a really nice secure connection. Let's test it. <gasps> yep, that feels good. So now we have our positive wires connected to the positive side of the light bulb. Now we're gonna take the positive wire that we connected to our light bulb and we're gonna connect it to the positive wire from our buzzer. To do this, we're going to have to do the same thing. Twist and twist and twist and twist and twist some more until we get a nice secure connection. So now that that is secure, we're gonna fold it in half just to make it extra secure. And then we are going to make it extra, extra secure with some electrical tape. So we're gonna wrap it nice and tight to help hold our connection in place. Next, we're gonna take our negative wire from the buzzer and attach it to, you guessed it, the negative side of the light bulb. We're gonna do the exact same thing, thread it around the screw, and now we tighten up our screw to secure our connection. Once that's nice and secure, we're ready to attach it to our board. So now we have our circuit wired up. We've got our energy source, our electrical load, we have our conductor, which is the positive and negative wires connecting it all together. All that's left is a switch to turn it on. So if we take this wire and we use it as a switch and connect it, the circuit is complete. Now let's take our circuit and stick it to the base. All right, everything looks good, but this circuit is definitely not gonna help us improve our focus. But you know what will? <gasps> Adding lots of twists and turns right in the middle of our circuit. <laughs> you know what? In order to make this thing ultimate, this is gonna take a while. Uh, maybe come back later. Ta-da! I have finished all of these twists and turns and ups and downs to create the ultimate focus challenge buzz wire game. This bad boy is gonna take some big focus to get through. As you can see, I poked little holes in the wall for the wire to go through. Now we're gonna make our switch. Now for this switch, we're gonna use a straw and copper wire. So we're gonna start by cutting our copper wire. Remember kids, ask an adult for help, especially when working with wire and things like that. Now I'm gonna use this glue stick to make a perfect little loop. We're just using it to shape our switch. There you go, that looks like a circle. Now we're gonna twist and twist and twist and twist and twist and twist and perfect. There we go, ooh. So now that we have our loop, we're gonna thread it through our handle, which is this straw, and all that's left is to bend the end up and secure it in place. Now we have our switch. Now we're gonna put our switch in place, just like that. Ta-da! Now that our switch is in place, we've bent the wire using pliers and we're hot gluing it to keep everything in place. Now let's connect our coil to our circuit. We are gonna use a negative wire to connect to the end of our coil. Once we have it connected and looped around, we're gonna hold it in place with some electrical tape. So after we have our wire nice and secure here, we need to secure our two negative wires from the battery and the coil together. So we are going to twist and twist and twist and twist and twist some more and make sure that connection is nice and secure. We're gonna use more electrical tape to wrap around the beginning of our coil. This will allow for a break in the circuit and the start of our game. Ta-da! Now for my favorite part, decorations. The decorations are done. We added a start line. We added a focus meter, which shows being not at all focused all the way to focused. And then we finished it off with the finish line. All that's left now is to complete our circuit using these alligator clips. Hello, alligator. What's going on? Boop, boop, boop. 
So first, we're going to take our alligator clip and connect it to the negative side of the light. Make sure it's nice and secure. That's not going anywhere. And then we're gonna connect our alligator clip to the bottom of our switch, making sure that it has good contact with the metal, just like that. And now it is complete. Oh gosh, I'm so radiant focused. Are we ready to start? Uh, I think we're ready to test it out. All right, let's test it out. That means it's time to get focused. <sighs> okay, let's see. Mm -hmm. Extreme focus to the max. Dun 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 The buzzer works. Woohoo! Well, I'm obviously not very focused, but I think it's safe to say that this works and it is ready to go to Ryan. Okay guys, thank you for watching the video. Remember always be happy and rise up. Bye. Bye! I can do it! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my god! Ronnie's touching it! No, I don't hear anything! Oh. I did it! Does it count? <laughs>